Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Rachel. Um, I'm going to be going to Aritzia today to try on some jeans, some denim for them, and a goldie jeans. So, hope you guys find this video helpful. For reference, I usually wear a size 4 at Aritzia and a 26 in Levi's jeans. The first pair I tried on are the Denim Forum Ferret jeans. These are a high-rise wide leg jean. The inseam is 28 inches, which I think is perfect on my 5'3 frame. This is in the color Picture This Blue, which is a light medium wash blue. Unfortunately, they didn't have the size 26, which is my usual size, in store that day, so I'm trying on the size 25, which fits a little bit too tight. Overall, I love the shape of these jeans and I love the rise on these jeans and definitely the length is perfect for shorter girls like me. The next pair is the denim form twiggy jeans and these look really similar to the previous one but these are just a little bit tighter on the thigh and then it becomes loose and flared at the bottom. So these are like a classic pair of flared jeans. This is also in the color picture this blue and I'm trying this one on in a size 26 which fits perfectly. The length on this is also 28 inches, so it hits perfectly below my ankles. I feel like this pair has a little bit more stretch in the jeans compared to the previous ones, the Farrah's. The next pair is the Nina jean, and these are a pair of cigarette jeans. They are super high rise. Um, I feel like this pair is a little bit more high rise than the previous two pairs that I've tried on, and the leg is also a skinnier. It's almost like a skinny jean, but just like slightly looser than a skinny jean. The length is 30 inches, which is too long for me, especially since it tapers inwards at the bottom. I would say these fit slightly larger since I'm trying on the size 25. The next pair of denim form jeans is the Joni, and this is a high-rise loose jean. The first thing I want to mention is that these fit extremely large, like at the waist, um, basically all around it just fits extremely large. I'm trying on the size 25 right now, which is a size smaller than my usual size, and it still feels extremely big. So definitely size down in these ones. The length is 29 inches, which is um, slightly longer than my preferred length, but it kind of gives that slouchy, loose look. So even though these are a little too long, I really like how the length looks on these jeans. Final pair of denim form jeans I tried on are the Mary Ann, and these are a mid-rise loose flare jeans. I don't think I've tried on mid-rise in so long, but I am not that big of a fan. I would say the leg is mixed between the Farrah and the Twiggy. The top is loose like the Farrah, and the bottom is flared like the Twiggy, so this is a nice in-between. I really wish these came in high-rise, but if you are looking for a mid-rise, I think this is a great option. Moving on to a Goldie. This pair is the 90s jean, and this is also a mid-rise loose fit jean. Even though these are mid-rise, I do feel like this is a lot more higher rise than the denim forum one. So this one, I would say it fits more like a high rise on me. I'm trying on the size 26, and it fits slightly loose on the waist, but I think that's just because this is supposed to be a loose fit. So I think these are very similar to the Joni jeans from denim forum. The next pair is the Ugoldi 90s pinch waist jean. These are a high-waisted pair of straight leg jeans. And exactly like the name says, these definitely pinch your waist. They fit extremely tight when I tried them on. And these are a size 26, which is my usual size. However, I do hear that Ugoldi jeans tend to stretch out over time. Hi, this is a future Rachel. So I tried on a lot of jeans that day when I went to Aritzia, but I didn't actually end up purchasing any of those jeans because it is so close to clientele, which is near the end of November. So I am planning on purchasing jeans during that sale so I can like save a few dollars. And I know that these jeans probably won't go out of stock during that time, so I'm okay with waiting. But what I did buy that day were the effortless pants, which I will insert a clip here. Um, I know these weren't jeans, but I saw these in stores that day and it was like the only one left and it just so happens to be my size. So I had to buy it because it was completely sold out online as well and they looked really, really good. Like I had to buy it even though these are probably the most expensive pants that I have 
ever bought. I strongly doubt they'll be around during clientele, so I just have to purchase it now. Um, and I'm pretty happy that I did because they are actually pretty comfortable because I've already worn it now. And by the way, these are the short version of the effortless pants. So the length is perfect because I'm pretty short and the color is called cognac, which I can't find online anymore, but it's like this dark brown. But yeah, back to the jeans. Since I haven't bought any jeans yet, I'm kind of still debating between which one I should get. I'm kind of leaning towards the, either the Farrah's or the Twiggy. So feel free to like comment down below which pair you think suits me the best. And if you have any of these jeans that I tried on and you want to share some of like your feedback and your experience with them, then please let me know in the comments because I would love to hear that. But yeah, I'm definitely waiting till clientele before I um, pick up a pair of these. And of course, I will be doing my clientele haul and everything this November so stay tuned for that hope you guys subscribe to my channel if you enjoy these kind of videos and thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next one